Hello, my beautiful people, and welcome, welcome to your love reading. I decided to do uh, a quick exclusive love reading. We haven't done romance readings in quite some time. I feel like most recently, um, you know, our, our channeled message readings has been um, revolving around career and finances and, you know, businesses, uh, institutions, which are all really nice. Many of you do have uh, blessings of prosperity um, that's coming towards you. But let's go ahead and see if I can, um, you know, channel some sort of love message for those of you who are interested in romance right now. Holy Spirit, thank you for guiding us. What is the message for someone out there when it comes to love, romance, love reading? It's a love message for someone out there. Hmm. Whoa. Okay. Knight of Pentacles, the Fool, and then Temperance fell out as well. I'm not sure if it was in the camera frame. Hmm. I have principles to full temperance. I was more about this message here. Five of Cups. Love reading. I think it's someone who's a bit, um, this person's a bit pessimistic, okay? They're not very confident that they will be able to come with you where you're headed. Like, you have a love interest who pretty much sees you as a shooting star. And they feel like you're far ahead of them um, on your soul journey. And that's okay. Everybody's on their own individual soul journey. And we're all going at the pace uh, that we're meant to be. Right? We all have our own pace. We're all at a destination that we're meant to be at. Um, but this is somebody who, who isn't sure that they will be able to catch up with you. Okay, they almost feel like uh, you will be leaving them behind and there's really nothing that they can do about it. They're showing up as the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles is the slowest moving energy in the deck. It is indeed. Uh, the Knight of Pentacles moves at a slow yet steady pace and you know slow yet steady always wins the race. There's no rush in this. This is your very own soul journey. But it's a person who is romantically interested in you and they don't want you to get too, you know, too far away from them where it'll be difficult for them to uh, connect with you. They are doing the best that they can. It could be that they got spiritually, maybe they started their spiritual journey, their spiritual awakening, um, you know, later than you did. And maybe you were even the one who helped spark their spiritual awakening. Uh, it's a beautiful connection, but I see two people who are just at different destinations along their soul journey. The full card is taking a leap of faith. You help this person. You help to open doors for this person. Indeed, they will experience their very own elevation and promotion. But I just feel like you are ahead of them, okay? Um, the temperance is peace and harmony. Now the two of you are on the same page. This person is seeing things from your perspective, okay? Maybe they had a difficult time seeing things uh, at, um, at your perspective in the past, but the two of you are on the same page. It's just that you've you've learned, they, they right now they're learning things that you've already learned, but the two of you do have the same agenda. The two of you do have mutual goals. Um, you know, so the situation where if you bring this person with you, um, I don't feel like they're going to slow you down. I don't. I just feel like it'll be more so of you'll be teaching them, okay? Because they'll be going through things that you've already been through, okay? Um, but I don't feel like they're going to slow you down or be of a liability on you. I don't, I don't see that. And it's because they, it's because of their ability to learn. They want to learn, okay? They want forward movement. Um, but yeah, they're just like, would you be willing to take them along with you on your journey? You know, the five of cups is here. They are pessimistic. They feel like you would most likely leave them out in the cold with the five of pentacles. Um, the two of wands is carrying out a plan. Yeah. This person knows that you're about to board. You're about to board the plane. <laughs> you know, this person knows that you're like a rocket. Oh, they see you as a queen of cups. Very loving. They see you as someone who's very loving, very kind, very genuine and sincere. 
but they just, they can sense that you're about to experience another elevation and they're like, oh crap, I don't know if I'm going to catch up as fast. And truly they don't have to. We're all like, you will meet people in your life who, who are ahead of you as well. They experience their soul awakening, their spiritual awakening, um, earlier than you did. So they are ahead of you and they, they can help you. They can help pull you up, right? They can help you through situations that they've also been through, just like how you can do the same for this individual. To watch the full reading, click the link in the description box.